Mr. Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, and welcome guests. To know wisdom and instruction, to perceive the words of understanding. The above phrase from Solomon's Book of Proverbs is said to be the first written down by Moses or Anasi after his invention of the Armenian alphabet. Today, I will tell you about the heritage of Armenian Today I will tell you about the heritage of Armenian literature, which is considered one of the major factors behind the survival of Armenian people. After this speech, I expect you to be able to name a number of masterpieces of Armenian literature. My speech will consist of three chapters about history, science, poetry, and two chapters about heritage and conclusion. Of the literature of pre-Christian Pagan Armenia, only a few fragments have come down to us. The remains consist of legends, songs, and fragments of epics. After Armenia accepted Christianity as its uh, state religion first in the world on 301 AD, most of the, rem of the records of the Pagan tradition were eradicated. Uh, a, a unique material on, Pagan, on uh, ancient legends of Pagan pre-Christian Armenia can be found in Armenian literature of the 5th century. The history of Moses Haranatsi, written in the 5th century, is an early account of Armenia, uh, history of Armenia uh, which cons covers the mythological origins of Armenian people. This work is recognized as a useful source for research of early Armenian history and ancient kingdom of Urartu, which was located on Lake Van in Armenian highlands. Another well-known Armenian another well-known Armenian historian of medieval epoch is Karun. After the death of, of Mashtots, he was given a task to write Masrov's biography. His book, The Life of Mashtots, contains a lot of information about the uh, evangelization of Armenia and invention of the Armenian alphabet. The period of time between 500 AD and 800 AD is generally considered the dark age of mathematics in the West. During this time, only few scattered centers remained where mathematical activity glimmered. One of such centers was school of mathematician and philosopher Anania Sharakatsi in Armenia. He, 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 he takes a unique place among the writers of the 7th century. One of important works of Sharakatsi is Tvobanutyun the world's first uh, manuscript on arithmetic. In this work, Shirakatsi presents his own methodology of teaching arithmetic to children. It doesn't require any fancy visual aids, it doesn't require memorization, and eliminates learning by heart. Shirakatsi's method develops a strong mathematical lost lasting knowledge. This method has been used effectively in Armenia for centuries and proves itself very useful. This 7th century methodology can be adopted and effectively used in tw by elementary school teachers in 21st century diverse classroom environments. From the late 10th century, novels and especially poetry grew considerably in Armenia. Well known was the name of Grigor Narikatsi, who lived in the 10th century. The world knows him as Armenia's first great poet. He wrote the book named Book of Proverbs, written shortly before the first millennium of Christianity. It is well known as gems of Christian literature. 
the Mesrok Mashtots Institute of Ancient Manuscripts or Matanadaran contains about 1700,000 manuscripts and other documents about history, geography, philosophy, arts, uh, science and medicine. It contains uh, a lot of documents by, by classical and medieval historians such as Novsens Hranatsi and Yegishe and other writings of no notable Armenian figures. Except Armenian literature, it contains more than 2,000 documents of <coughs> historical doc documents written in different uh, foreign languages such as Arabic, Japanese, uh, Russian, and etc. In this presentation, I described you a number of masterpieces of Armenian literature from the Pagan tradition till the first millennium of Christianity. I told you why these masterpieces are widely known and accepted. I told you why they may be interesting to you, whether because they can contain interesting historical information or because they contain some methodology which can be used for education or because it contains interesting poetry. I hope that after this speech you will be able to name a num number of masterpieces of Armenian literature. Mr. Toastmaster.